I'm Ali and I'm the manager of the Chelsea Adventure Playground. We were um, contacted by Simon at Splash and he said that there was a possibility that we might be chosen for a Splash project. Uh, and I didn't think for a moment that we would actually be the ones that got it. We're on the wall team, the big climbing wall, uh, and we decided to go for, after some debate, we decided to go for one section wall, so eight metres length in total, and uh, we're just working out which tools we're going to need for the job, basically. We're basically planning out what goes where, just before everyone starts building, so we know where all the elements are going. <laughs> we're feeling very positive. A little bit scared. The worst thing is, we have to get there before everyone else to plan it all out before they start building, so I guess we need to get there pretty early. My first reaction when the project brief came out, when the project brief was finished, was I have no idea how we're going to achieve this, I have no idea how we're going to get organised and get things sorted out. But actually, everybody jumped in with both feet and um, I'm, I'm reasonably confident. Maybe, maybe I shouldn't be, but I'm reasonably confident that tomorrow we're going to get done what needs to get done and deliver a good project. I'm the, uh, yeah, I'm the store man, so I've got a very important role, apparently. <laughs> I'm managing the shovels. A lot to do, a lot to get organised. I think everyone's going to have to pitch in and help each other and really have a, you know, a cliché team spirit, but if we're going to get this done, that's what we need. Coming on site this morning has been great, actually. It's been really good. Uh, uh, great space. Um, a little bit smaller than I thought it was going to be, but uh, fantastic. Really, really good project to be doing. Really looking forward to it. I think the Dunhill team are doing fantastically. I was really surprised how quickly they got into the project and the motivation and, and I think they're having fun. And I think if any company can come in and start working and get going by 10 o'clock, they're on for a good start. But we'll see what happens after lunch when they've had a, a big chilli and a hot curry. It's going OK, a little bit of trial and error. We've had to uh, take one post out and put it back in again so we didn't quite get the height right. But um, we're learning on the job. We've got about 90 handle grips to attach to the wall. We've got to put a back on it as well, so I don't know how long it's going to take. And we are building the foundation holes for the small tunnel. I think we're doing brilliantly. Uh, some minor problems with the size of things, how deep we have to go, the width, and basically the overall project. But other than that, I think we're going to be fine. Yeah, it's exciting. But you must leave us now, we have to work. Excited to get involved in the project because. Um, I think it's a really good thing that Daniel has decided to do to get sort of not only to get everyone together to do something, but to do something really positive for the community. The team we're on is the wall team, the climbing wall team. Um, I'm the team leader for that team. These are the, this is the rest of the team working behind us here, most of them, just finishing off the last post, putting in the, um, in the concrete. I think yesterday's briefing session was uh, we were all new to it, we weren't really sure what we were going to be doing. Today it's all come, to, come together really, really well. Everybody's working really together in their team. Everybody's very clear what they need to do. So I think um, it's going really well. It's going very well. It's going very well. It's going very well. When we're the sun's gone in. That's a uh, very <laughs> enjoyable day. Really could be a bit warm. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Okay. okay. Thank you very much. Food. It's going well. I feel drilled out at the moment. I've been drilling all morning. Yeah, it's, it's really nice. Yeah, it's yeah. great. Yeah. Yeah. Very challenging, good. It makes you feel Yeah. <laughs> Let's right. get some lunch, guys. Thank you. <laughs> Feeling confident. Yes. I think we're going to get it finished. Yes. We've got the tricky bits to do after lunch and all the balustrades for us. But uh, yeah, yeah, we're nearly good. finished with our one as well. Nearly the big tunnel is finished now, so we just need to do like little bits like the chains and nearly done. Yeah. Looking forward to lunch now. I'm feeling very hungry. Yeah, hungry. But it's going okay, I think. Yeah. Yeah, cargo net's nearly done finally. 
it's nice to see everything kind of getting shaped, isn't it? Well, uh, we're a little behind, oh. but I think uh, we're going to be positive. okay. Yeah, I'm feeling really positive. We've got yeah. the drills, you know. Got the wood cut. Wood's cut, yeah. And we're looking forward to some lunch and getting recharged. Uh, we're up against time. We need to really crack on in the afternoon. Yeah. Yeah. We don't want to let the kids down, so we want to get it done. So, we've got about two hours to go. Uh, it's just started to rain. People are sort of dashing around, last minute panics. I think we're confident. We won't, get, won't take as long to finish this off. Then we can move on to uh, the tops on. Confident, it will get, it'll get, it'll get achieved. Two hours, I'm not quite sure. At the moment, I'm going, I've gone through the balance beams. I hope we've been dug there. I'm worried about my batteries. I don't want to let everybody down. Final 10 minutes, uh, last minute bits, tying up. Um, all hands on deck, everyone's sweeping, and um, what else are they doing? Just the last things, and we've kind of seen the whole thing from start to finish overview, and it's been pretty impressive watching everyone work. Uh, today was a lot of hard work, a lot of blood, sweat, and tears, but I think completely worth it when the kids started running around and playing. It made it absolutely worthwhile doing. It was really good. It was much harder work than I thought it was going to be. But everyone bucked in and I can't believe we actually got it finished in time. I don't think people realise when they volunteer what they actually do. And I think a lot of it is, you know, this playground is also used by mainstream children where their mothers come in. Um, and they pay a certain amount of money to use the playground. Well, this is obviously going to be even more attractive. They'll run, they'll come past, they'll see it, the children will want to play, more revenue, it goes straight back into the club. I think when the kids turn up and, and seeing the kids shouting and getting excited and straight away jumping on it just makes the whole day just totally worthwhile. It's been pretty, pretty good. And for me, just hearing from one of the parents how much it means for everyone to yeah. get involved and um, how much difference it makes to her child in particular's life, that's what it's all about. I'm a single mum and I bring up Cullen by myself, so it's kind of, it's, you feel very isolated, very alone. And then when you see volunteers that have got nothing to do with autism, nothing to do with special needs, and they want to come in and do something, you don't feel quite so alone. I had so much fun, even though it rained a bit, and yeah, no, it's been great. It's been really good. I mean, I've been at that company for two weeks now, and that shows how great it is. The company was good to get to know the people, so it's all good now. I can't wait to go play.